What's up guys, it's your Bazaar and I'm excited to create expressive portraits with you in over today. Tap the countdown, I'll see you later. <sighs> Hi guys, I'm so honored and so excited to be here with you guys. Well, first off, my name is Shabazz. Um, my user and business name is Shabazz Art. Um, I'm an artist from South Carolina. I am a visual artist. I do um, paintings. I do expressive portraits like like this and over. And I over has really launched my whole visual perspective of everything. And so I'm just I'm just so honored to be here, and I'm excited um, to show y'all how to create expressive portraits. All right, well, let's jump into it. From Argentina, oh, that's awesome. All right. So, just to start off, I already selected my image, um, and what I'm essentially doing is using my, my um, not my masking tool, but I'm using my, the tool, um, I'm using my tool that I use to get rid of all the edges, and I'm literally like, like as if I'm like cutting hair, like as if I'm doing hair, I'm literally like going precisely, and I'm going in and out. I, I usually scrape off the eyelashes because I'm just so lazy that I can't even can't even get inside those crevices. So it's kind of hard. So I just go ahead and get rid of those. Um, and then I select my background, which is a gradient. I usually go to um, what I do is I go in, I go to my graphics, and I type in gradient, and I pick any type of gradient there is. Um, and before. I took a circle, as you can see, like in and out. I took a circle and I literally took that, blended it. I took my masking tool and blended it. Um, I'm using Over. Um, and I'm also recording on my iPad, so yes. And I'm also taking my masking tool again, just to give y'all that portrait style, because we're not doing neck or shoulder or anything like that. I'm taking my masking tool and I'm literally shaping, I'm literally like, as if I'm like, sculpting like it's like a sculpting for me and it's so awesome so i um essentially move around that i'm checking my border to see if i have any colors left over and you usually see what's left over after you use the gradient tool um and after you um go within so i'm cutting off the head i am literally like pushing her whole wig back it's crazy um <laughs> so i'm um what i'm essentially about to do is go back into my options and select the image and i'm going to select the moon but i i think i looked this image up in google um <laughs> with the image that they have <laughs> um yes i'm using the masking tool for anyone that is trying to figure out um i didn't even show y'all the end result of what this image looks like um so yes this is a moon i chose the moon because I, I realize the moon is associated with emotions and the um, the emotions that tie with femininity, I chose that image specifically. Um, I, I, I'm using the moon as a guide to line up, you know, that, that circle area. So I'm, you know, when I'm editing and I, as I'm editing on my iPad, I'm really like turning my iPad side to side, like left to right. And I'm trying to figure out, okay, how can this look? How does this look good? How does that look? Um, and I chose I chose the moon for a for a feminine aspect. Um, I use my fingers. I always use my fingers. I wish I had an apple pencil. That probably make my life so much better. But we don't have the luxury of that right now. But um, yes, and I'm going back into my images, back into my graphics, and I'm selecting um, something earthy, something plant like that it can give me like this this woman vibe, like this woman vibe, and there you have it. I'm going to show y'all. This is the end result. Yes. So I'm just gonna wrap this up. Um, I thank everybody for watching. Um, you guys can follow me at Shabazz Art. That's S H A B A Z Z A R T. Also, you can find me on all platforms. That's Shabazz Art. You can find me on YouTube. Um, I do YouTube videos. I also do tarot readings. If you guys are interested in that. And also, um, I have a website at ShabazzArt.com as well. You can all find follow, find all of my art and all of my um, all of my projects, everything that I've done in my on my website. Um, you can also see all the artwork I have for sale as well. 
So yes, I am excited and I am honored to have done this with Over. Such a pleasure, such an honor. You guys take care and safe travels, all right? Be safe.